my beautiful and amazing people i don't come again with another obonge gist this time around a very sweet gist and a very wonderful one but before i go into the deep detail of this matter if today is the first time when they come across this channel you are highly welcome and to all those who say they come back come watch my new upload now baba god now go bless all of you so my people may go into this detail for this video because my belly is sweet me way for this one so i start actress Genevieve Unanji early this year the news breakers for internet say she get Kolo Menta says she did Wodo Yibo, they receive treatment and true true, she can't deactivate her page, delete all her pictures for most. Now, so people they pray for Ram, they didn't intercede. But thank God, now a few weeks ago, she come out, she go one event. We'll be say that video go via away away because people were so happy to see her. She was looking chubby and all. Now, they find out now, say she's pregnant again. She's pregnant for her second child, though. After many years, when she born her first baby, when she did very young, now she's pregnant again, and we are so happy for her because when she come out to contact that day, people come to say, ah, this woman looks so pregnant though. Say she come day chubby. I told myself they would they shoes one kind one kind. She wear a very massive gown, but now we don't the year and now say na belle ninety days so. I really day happy for her and I want to say congratulations to her. May God give her all her heart desire. She'll be one of our legends. I know it's easy to carry Belle for the cage when she did now because she did in her forties. So we really day grateful to God for her life and she's already a grandmother for all those we don't know. You know, see her daughter Mary years ago so she's a granddaughter that is expecting a baby. So congratulations to Genevieve. May God bless her, may God eat her completely. Maybe say she did sound and healthy forevermore. So for those who know watch the video of when she say come out, I will play the video for you now and make you now watch them. Chairman of Board of Directors, Sir Frank Zimbang, His Excellency, Professor Benedict O. Arama, the Minister of Culture and Francophone, His Excellency, Honorable Francios Riman, Her Excellency, all ministers present, the Executive Vice President, Inter African Trade Initiative, Sir Zimbang, Mrs. Kanayo Awan. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm honored to be speaking at Scanex Weekend 2022. Thank you for having me. As creatives, we have transcended borders and our influence is truly global. However, the creative industry remains fragmented, segmented, and unable to scale, at least not in terms of revenues. Africa has a profound, beautiful, and influential cultural legacy a cultural legacy that can be worth trillions. Yet, Africa's share of it is only 1%. And this is where we have the possibility of having the greatest impact. As critical stakeholders involved in the cultural and creative industry, CCIs, 